Hi teachers, this video is going to walk you through the Desmos test mode app that has been added to Chromebooks. There's going to be two different ways students can access this and it's really going to depend on when you are using it. So the first way is it has been installed as a Chrome app at the high school level. It's already been pinned to the bottom so students should see it when they sign back into their Chromebooks as Desmos test mode. The other way that students can get to it, or middle school students, because I didn't want to force pin it on all of the profiles since not everyone's going to be using it, is they can just click their app launcher in the bottom left hand corner and Desmos test mode should pop up, but if it doesn't, they can click the up arrow and locate the app there. If it's not pinned and they would like to pin it, they're just going to two finger click on the app and select pin. That will ensure that it stays at the bottom. It's the same thing that we have done with the calculator app um, for the TI-84 simulator. Now, using the Desmos test mode this way is not in a lockdown. So they can use a Chrome browser as well. This probably would be best when you are actively teaching and you want to use um, the Desmos test mode while you are teaching. That way they can still navigate to everything else on the Chromebook as well. Now, if you are testing or you want to simulate more that lockdown browser that students can actually, when they do the Desmos test mode on their phone and it locks things down, you do have the option on a Chromebook as well. Today is March 22nd and it probably will not show up until March 23rd. So I am going to show you what this looks like and then you can have students look for it starting tomorrow. So the first thing students have to do is sign out of the Chromebook. They're going to select apps and from the app list will be the Desmos test mode. So this is actually where students get all those lockdown browsers for our different state testing or district testing. If they click Desmos test mode here, it is going to load that test mode in lockdown so there's no access to an internet browser, there's no access to YouTube or any of the other sites. It is just the graphing calculator, scientific or for function. Once I go ahead and start the test, this probably looks similar to what maybe you're used to with the student um, phones. When they click done, they will get the you have been using the number of minutes and then it does remind them that they can either continue their session or in order to exit this kiosk mode, they have to completely restart the Chromebook and that will get back them, them back into the regular mode of the Chromebook where you have the browser and everything else. So these are both options for you. Hopefully this helps you better utilize this app and then you won't have to have students using phones. They can be using their Chromebooks for the same purpose. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out. Remember students will need to be logged in on their district Chromebook in order to access um, the kiosk mode that we're currently in, they will be able to get access to that Desmos test mode app on a personal device through their Chrome account as well.